the fun part about it was that he talks about one particular thing that applies a lot to desktop, which is learning loops. It's a psychological term. It's been psychology for years, where you have a mental model. The user has a mental model, and they have an intent. So then they look on the screen, and they find an affordance to do their action, and they get a result, which gives them feedback. And then what happens is you go back to the loop, and you learn. So if you click on a button, and you miss it, you go, well, okay, you, you, something happened. Well, then you click on it, and it highlights. Ah, okay. And you, you learn how these things work, and the visual interaction teaches you things, and it's a very subtle, very tiny thing. And I love his way of phrasing this. He goes, fun is just another word for learning. And so he really basically pushes this in these games that you have to teach people how to use your product, and the more they learn, the more fun they have. I think that's a very powerful idea. So the way he used, talks about this was going back to the, the, the OG game, Super Mario, and um, Super Mario Brothers, is you really just have a left and right and a jump button when you start off, and you're behind actually this little pipe, and you kind of go back and forth, like this is, this is kind of boring. Right. And you learn to jump, and then you still get stuck. And eventually, you learn to time your jump to go on top. You've learned your first loop, right, to be with time and jump. Then when you get over to this area above, if you hold the jump button down a little bit longer, then you jump into it, and you hit this thing, and you get a, a power-up. Right? And then when you finally get to the monster, you're like, oh, I've been jumping enough. Maybe if I time it just right, I can land on him, and then boom. So what you've done is with one button jump, you've now basically moved pushed and attacked, as opposed to you know, the, the naive programmer approach would be to say, I have three buttons that do all three functions. But no, no, they're trying to do everything with one button. And I think that's very subtle, and it's fun.